Okay, we're going to grease these gears in here. Let me see if I can get them in there. Okay, now these plastic gears right here, and this one's metal, this big combing one back here. Okay, but these plastic gears, this plastic gear, you want to grease those with. This grease is good. This is kind of a gelled grease. It's called Petro Gel. It's the same thing I use on my KitchenAid stand-up mixer. You can get this at a restaurant supply. It's like seven to ten dollars, um, or you can order it online. Um, this is actually food grade. You don't have to use food grade, but this is clear and it's not messy, so. I'm going to take this, and I'm going to put it on a Q-tip. Take a little bit of that, and I'm going to put it on this gear. Spread it around this gear a little bit, and get it on this lower gear, too. Okay, now I'm going to go into this back gear in here and put some on there. I'll just drag it across. Probably a little bit much, but we'll see. It's probably okay. We'll drag it across that gear and turn it. Now I've already cleaned this machine up pretty good. Now I'm going to go to this gear right here. Even though this is all smooshed up, you can still get a ton out of it. Okay, I'm going to put some on this gear. I'm going to go back down here to this bottom gear. And I'll run the rest of this on this other one. And then I will turn the machine over and see if there's any I gotta do on the bottom that are plastic geary things. Let's see. Let's see what this side looks like. Okay, this one down here. I put a hair on there. Some of that's just the sewing machine oil I use. I'll put a little bit on there. That's my adjuster dial for my stitches. See it turning in there? Okay, now I'm going to look on the bottom, see if there's any I need on the bottom. I'm not a great fan of plastic gear machines. Singer doesn't use a lot of plastic. Okay. That's the gear we just greased. Okay, we got one over here.
that's by the bobbin case. And I got a little bit of the other grease on there, a little bit of that oil. But this is better for this plastic stuff. Let's go around in here. Turn the dial and see what it does. Get some over here. And you can open this too, but cut it open and scrub a whole bunch of oil out of that. And put it like in a little cup or a plastic baggie. Looks really good. Okay. Let's flip it up. Make sure you wipe down everything with alcohol, like your electric. Make sure your motor and your belt get alcohol and cotton of some sort. I think we've about got it. All right. Sounds like a winner to me. So there you have it. And this is my light oil that I use. This three in one. All right. You have a great one. Talk to you later.